Brad, felt like you were coming for them there at the end. Um, I'm sure hugely disappointed that you couldn't come away with the win. Yeah. Um, we're coming with effort and, you know, we've got plenty of fight and resolve that, you know, we've been out there right at the depths in all three games, but um, we need more than just, you know, fronting up with effort. Um, each week we need to, we need to execute our, our plan um, and that's probably more individually at the moment. It's, different stages, individuals, uh, lack of concentration or um, just some simple fundamentals were getting wrong which is really hurting us. What, what happened at the start there because you know they just got away from you quite quickly? Uh, well we had, I think we had four sets down in good ball we didn't get to the end of the set on any of those. Um, I had 12 or 13 sets to our five sets or something like that so it was just purely possession so we're just making it hard on ourselves, shooting ourselves in the foot, beating ourselves, making it very tough. Um, we had plenty of fight to come back from that, but you know, with the amount of tackles we had to do early, and then you know, we clawed our way back in just before half time and started well in the second half, but then shot ourselves in the foot again. These big score lines yeah. um, are a worry. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Look, you know, it's all right scoring 30, but we're, we're conceding six tries, five tries, two tries a week, four. You feel for Jermaine, given how hard he's worked? Yeah. Yep. Yeah, look, it's unfortunate. It's not why we lost the game. No. But um, there's too many of those moments, you know, where the, the tries are, are too easy. I felt like we scored some good footy tries over the last couple of weeks, but the tries against us are just um, too easy. It's only round three, Brad, but it's a tough fortnight come up as well. You don't yep. want to spot these rivals too big a lead already at this point of the season, do you? Yeah, look, it's not ideal, but you know, this is a good test for us, a good test of our character, that we stick together, we don't start looking to blame anyone else or you know, listen to too much opinion. We know exactly what we need to do to get ourselves back on track. Um, we just got to go out and do it. Um, yeah, it's, it's tough, but the NRL's tough. Um, so this is good, you know, a real good challenge for us, an opportunity to, to show what we've got. Mato's back. Does he come straight back into the team next week? Yeah, he'll be, he'll be in the 17 somewhere. Um, got a couple of um, injuries out tonight, so we'll just have to wait and see how they, they are um, tomorrow. Is it a serious injury? Or? Well, I'm not too sure. I yeah, didn't think it was great, but I don't know how serious. And um, obviously with the new rules with Merch, he didn't come back out, so I'm thinking that's he's out next week. How do, you, how do you explain where your defence has gone from at the end of last year to the first few rounds of this season? Um, sorry, I missed the start of that one. So you? I was just saying, how, like, how do you explain or how do you sort of feel where your defence has gone from from the end of last season to the first few rounds of this season? Oh, it's frustrating. Um, as Brad said, we're, we've been scoring some pretty good footy tries and we're just letting in soft tries. Um, just one off the rough runs from Turbo tonight. They scored three off kicks. Um, they're the ones you can't can't just give in week in week out that's that's a cheap try and um it's hurt us the last three weeks and um that's probably part of why we're losing and at such a high score line because we're letting in those tries and um just letting teams get full sets in and then in with an easy kick brad the changes to your edges obviously you lost both your edge second rowers for injury or leaving the club like do you think that's been part of the challenge for you guys like obviously manly did a bit damage around the edges tonight oh look it's not their fault, you know, we've got some work to do there, but when you're completing that 58% to start the game and you, you know, we have to make that many tackles, well, and it's hard to, you know, get that pressure on from the inside and they just, they just get into our edges too easily. Um, so we've got some work to do there, but we're not going to single out or blame any positions or any players, we're all in it together and, and we'll turn it around. Um, but we need to do it straight away. And just one on the block next year. In a, in a losing team, like have you seen a better performance in a losing team the way Guffo was able to lift you guys back into that game? Yeah, well, he, his effort and his want and his desire to win is there for everyone to see and it's infectious. So um, I don't think anyone there tonight didn't have the effort or didn't want to win, but you know, we, got, we need 17 players for whatever time they're on the field to execute their role. And that's what we're lacking at the moment. All right, cool. Thanks. Thank you.